Hello, everyone. Welcome. 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 ACP Health and Wellbeing Committee Health Fair. I can. We are so happy you all, you all are here. We didn't know what was going to happen today, but we were going to, uh, our health tour was going to go on whether it rained or shine, and we are so thankful for you, our, commi our, our community, for coming out and supporting us. Um, we will, we had a, a weekend of events. Everyone knows that this is the Old Timers Day weekend. Last night, we had a meet and greet at the community center. Today is our health fair, tomorrow's our barbecue, and we want all of you to come out tomorrow. We'll have the vendors. Um, the, at some point, they're gonna come forth and talk about the, uh, their merchandise that they're, they're promoting. But we just wanna say thank you. Um, my name, if you don't know, my name is Michelle Brown. I am the chairperson for the Health and Wellbeing Committee. Thank you so much. This is our first one, and I, I know we're gonna make some changes um, for next year, so just, you know, stay tuned. But we just wanna say welcome, and uh, I'd like to introduce our chair, our, per, our president, Minister Kiana Hobbity. She is the president of the North Shore NAACP. So thank you so much for coming out. Stay, there's a lot to, you know, a lot to do. We have, oh, I just wanna let you know that we will have some Zumba couple of uh, two half hour Zumba classes. So I hope you have your sneakers and you're ready to move around after you finish eating your hamburgers and your hot dogs. Okay? Mr. Ken uh, Hobbit. You're too close, you're too close. And welcome everyone. And um, although you had the official welcome for Dr. Brown, I just want anybody and everybody who can hear my voice to just get up, give a, a loud roar and a clap and a thank you to Dr. Michelle Brown, who really came up with the idea. And all we did was actually just become ladder holders for the vision that she had for this health fair so we really want to give credit the Bible says give honor where honor is due so we're giving honor today to our dr. Michelle Brown for all the work and effort that she put into this all the tireless calls and for those who actually said yes and came out so thank you to everybody we also want to just welcome those who are vendors on today um, a lot of our vendors or a few of our vendors did not show up because you know they thought that the weather was going to uh, not be so great but it turned out to be a beautiful day and so for those vendors who are here again thank you very much we also want to give you an opportunity if you are here today and you want to come back out tomorrow for more exposure to be able to tell everyone what it is that um, what resources and services you provide we're allowing you and asking you to please again show up tomorrow you're welcome to come set up at about 10 o'clock tomorrow um, and so that's all again thank you everyone for coming and I'll turn it over to our vice president um, dr. Doctor, oh, Desiree, maybe you're going back to school, to Desiree Woodson. Good morning, everyone. How is it? And it would not, we have to introduce this, this phenomenal woman who is a community member, and uh, she's Miss Desiree Woodson. She's going to be our host for the week. We had two hosts, but one of our hosts was uh, stuck in Mexico. I know everybody else knows about the weather that's, uh, you know, the, the hurricane, so she was not able to be here today. But Miss Desiree, uh, Woodson, she is the second vice president for the NAACP North Shore Branch, and she's the North Hempstead Housing Authority Tenant Commissioner. So we'd like to welcome Ms. Desiree Woodson. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Brown. Thank you so much. Thank you guys for coming out here today. This is the first year that we've um, having this health fair, and it's going to be a part annually, I hope, um, a part of the Old Thomas Weekend, which is sponsored and led in the Manhasset Valley Community Foundation, with, uh, which I am a part of, its executive board. I'm also chairwoman of the board of directors of the Manhasset Great Neck EOC. Although I wear many hats, my love is for my community and the children within it. And I just try to be wherever I need to be to get the information that it comes back to the community and that we're all involved and we come together as one to do what we need to do. The children are our future. So with all that being said, we are going to, let me see what's on the schedule. Councilwoman DeSena was here earlier. She will be in attendance tomorrow, but she's not here today. So we have um, an elected official here. We have Marion Dalmonte, Councilwoman Dalmonte. She's over here under the umbrella. 
And um, I just want you guys to say there was a lot of confusion behind the scenes about this day and sponsorship of this event. There are plenty of sponsors of today, but one of our biggest sponsors is the town of North Hempstead. And without her support and help, it kind of would have fell under the cracks. So this, we just want to give her a round of applause and thank you for her due diligence. And although she represents the town of North Hempstead and Port Washington and other areas, she's always here to support this community. So, well, Miriam, would you like to come up and say something? Please, I want people to, to know the face and the name and <laughs> know who you are. And we have Northwell Hospital, Christine Patty. Christine, can you wave your hand in the back? Christine has helped us cultivate this day and put everything together. And we have the um, blood pressure screening. We have Narcan training. We have all kinds of things thanks to Northwell Health as well as their sponsorship for tomorrow's Old Timers Day. But we've just come together to make this weekend as a success. Here's Marion Delmonte. What? So, uh, is it morning or afternoon? It's good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to the park. And um, I have to give a shout out to former Councilwoman Veronica Lurvie. She, um, we added this to the budget last year, and we, I voted on it, and I saved my records and made sure that the new Councilwoman, Christine Liu, who wanted to be here today, but unfortunately, she uh, broke her collarbone. I don't know if she'll be here tomorrow either. She's gonna try, but she's in a lot of pain. So, um, but we really have to give a lot of credit to Councilwoman uh, Lou and Councilwoman, uh, former Councilwoman uh, Veronica Lurvie for making this event with the town happen with Desiree and everyone here. So thank you very much, enjoy your day, and I will be back here tomorrow to celebrate Old Timers Day with you. Thank you so much, Councilwoman. So going forward, I'm not sure how many of the um, NAACP subcommittees are present, but we have the Health and Wellbeing that, um, Committee, which is run by Dr. Brown, who spoke a few minutes ago. We have the Education Committee, but, which is run by um, Ms. Kiana Burton, which is also a vice president of the NAACP North Sh Shore chapter. Kiana, are you anywhere around? Okay. And then we also have the criminal justice, which is run by um, Mrs. Monique Halliburton Esquire. I don't know if she's here. Is she here? Oh, she's over there. Hi, Monique. <laughs> we also have um, religious affairs by Dr. Kim Spivey Hunter, who is stuck in um, vacation due to the hurricanes. We have the youth in college, Miss Natanya Lewis. She's over there, set up at a table, representing her marketing company. If you guys get a chance to go over there and stop at her table as well. We have civic engagement, Mr. Rory Lansman. I don't know if Rory's here today. No, I haven't seen him, but that's civic engagement. And then we have membership, enrollment, membership forms, and fees. We are taking membership, registration, um, we have a barcode that you can scan. You can sign up at your own leisure. But if not, my mom is at a table in the front entrance of the park via the NAACP banner. And you can be a part of all the awesomeness that we're doing and that we will do. Thank you all for coming out. So now we'll have um, Christine. Would you like to say a few words on behalf of the Senior Community Relations Program, please? This is sad. Yes, round of applause for Christine. She's here with us on her, her, her time. That's all right. Hi, everybody. Uh, thank you so much for be having us here with you today. We're so excited to have the opportunity. We're doing blood pressure screenings. Um, if you see when you come in, we have the mobile unit. It's air conditioned, so a good excuse to get out of the heat, get your blood pressure checked. Uh, we also have Narcan training. We're actually giving kits that you can take home if you take the training. We have diabetes education, mental health resources, a lot of great resources and education for you today. Um, and then that's just and we'll be doing an exercise demonstration in the next couple minutes so uh, something light and low impact since it's kind of hot we'll uh, we'll keep it nice and easy for you thank you thank you Christine so we all, we're gonna have now the introduction of our 
um, vendors. I use the text session. We have Mrs. Daphne Perry leads the Stony Brook Center of Excellence for Alzheimer's and Disease Team. We have Mrs. Janine Morrison, Outreach Team Leader, Community of Mental Health Promotion and Support. We have Mr. Anmoon Haida, Fidelis Care, Community Relations from the Long Island region. And we have Health First Insurance Company. We also have Kiosha Swimwear, in the back here with the beautiful umbrella she's there waving. If you guys get a chance to walk around, just please visit some of these tables and get some of the information and some of the items they have to offer. We also had um, Mrs. Michelle Thomas. What's her, Miss Lady? She's a vendor here. We're going to have all of these people come up and talk about, um, and we have Darlene over at um, Distinctive Divas. She's helping out Shelly today. They're partners. Um, we have the Young Authors Corner. We have London over in the back. Wave your hand, London. I can see you from here. <laughs> If you guys get a chance, just please walk around. Look what they have to offer. Um, there's also kids' activities. There's arts and crafts in the back. If you walk around, you'll get a feel of kind of what's going on and what, what we have to offer. I'm sorry for the late start, but um, due to the weather, that's what we had to do. Hello. Hi, I'm Karis. I'm a physical therapist at North Shore uh, University Hospital right up the street. And I'm just here to do some kind of light, gentle stretching with you guys. Nothing strenuous since it's so hot. Um, Slap on the So yeah, you can do it sitting. They're seated stretches. And you can just kind of go through them with me slowly if you feel like it. Um, yeah, and hopefully it helps you release some tension. Perfect. So to begin with, we'll just start with kind of loosening up the head and the neck. So you bring your shoulder, sorry, your ear to your shoulder, and you can let your head drop forward and around to the other side. This means to get up and go And you can go through these slowly, make sure you're breathing, drop your head forward, your ear to the other shoulder. Good. Right, Nick. You go through it a few times, noticing any areas of tension. Right, if there is any tension at a place you want to stop and stay, you can stay there for a little bit. All good. Nice truth. Additionally, you can put your hand to your head for a deeper stretch, not really pulling or anything, just letting the weight of your arm to help your head and neck to a deeper stretch. You can also drop the other arm down. That'll give you a deeper stretch here. And you can do the same thing on the other side. And then another one you can do is kind of slowly nodding, like you're nodding yes. And slowly nodding like you're nodding no. And still, which will be bad thing to be and then rolling the shoulders back. And when you roll the shoulders back, that's a good way to open up the chest. A lot of us are either at computers all day long, or we're at our phones and we're hunched forward, or just as we age, we start to hunch. So it's a good opportunity to roll your shoulders back, open your chest. As you roll back, you inhale. I'm gonna try to And roll forward and breathe out. <laughs> And just do that a few times until you feel a little looser. And then you can go in the opposite direction. And then next we're going to do what's kind of like a modified yoga position. It's a seated cat-cow. So similar, similarly, you're pushing the chest out forward. You're kind of exaggerating the arches of your back. Letting your head drop back. That's it. Then come forward and let your head drop forward. 
exaggerating the curve in your back. Hey, Rick Rams. And you can do that again. Inhale while your chest is nice and expanded and open. Exhale, drop forward. Inhale, chest out. Exhale, chest forward. Do that a couple of times. From that position, when your chest is out, you can kind of open up your chest, reach the back of your chair. That's a nice stretch. Then we can twist a little bit. You can take your hand and bring it to the opposite side. And most. And bring the other arm over your body. And then hold it so right. You can do the same thing. But this may push to me. Two. Because it's too dark. And do the opposite side. So bring your arm across you. Hold your chair to kind of anchor yourself. That helps with the stretch. And then reach the other arm over. I'm not doing it. Thank you. Can wait. Let's repeat that again for each side. Go through it a couple of times, just feel comfortable. It's fat. 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 It's I'll do a forward fold. So you're going to open your arms all the way up and wide. Separate your feet, reach all the way up to the ceiling. Stretch out your back a little bit. And then come down towards the floor. And breathe in and breathe out. Come up a little bit. And exhale and you sink deeper into it. This is great for the back. Then come all the way up, you roll up slowly, and do it again. Arms all the way out and wide. Reach up towards the sky, and lean back a little bit. Fold down forward. Come up a little bit. Exhale and come down again deeper into the stretch. One more time, all the way up. Reach forward to the sky. Come all the way down. One foot. Inhale, exhale. Hi, sir. Inhale up. Oh. And exhale down. And there's a, a few standing stretches. I don't know. One is like holding the back of a chair or something. You can do some side lunges to get your inner thighs. They get tight. Sounds good. That's two foot the door. So I didn't use deer things. They have big wrists. Slip on two tanks. You. you do some forward lunges. Here too. Drive your hip forward. Step forward wide and drive your hip forward. Forward. Switch sides. Step forward wide. And drive your hip forward. And then another one is a modified yoga pose. That's the downward dog. So you can do this like sitting in front of a desk, or you can do it standing with a chair where you step far back, you reach forward to the chair, and you let your chest and your head drop between your arms. Thanks. good. So similarly on a chair, you could push your chair back, reach your hands towards your desk, and let your chest and your head drop between your arms. Yeah. Yeah, back. All right, thank you. I do. Great work. Let's go. Let me go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. And then we'll just do a, the arm stretch or two. Thank you, Bill. Can you do it? clasp your hands and push them out in front of you. Then we'll share that. Out to either side. Spending a half an hour to show that you're good. Thank you, Bill. You can bring one arm across your chest. Other can back. Hold with the other arm. Maybe. And gently pull towards you. And hold that there. Are you breathe? Yeah, that's true. Head and chest. Switch into the other side when you're on the cross. 
the other arm holds it and gently pulls. And the last one I'm going to show you is a tricep stretch. You're going to take your hand, place it on the same side shoulder. Use the other arm to gently push up your shoulder. And if that's not much of a stretch, you can bring your arms up and over your head and push back. And then to come out of stretching kind of gently before you get back to what you were doing, generally sit with your palms up and do some breathing. Relax your body. See what feels tight, what feels looser now. And that is that. And it's rebirth. Yeah, rebirth. Good afternoon, everyone. That's cute. Okay, y'all active, y'all active. Good afternoon. I want to first, before I introduce myself, I just want to say thank you to Dr. Brown. Thank you to Minister Kiana for just putting this beautiful event together. Thank you to each person who took time and um, just energy to come out today. I appreciate it. My name is Natanya Lewis. I am a graduate of Syracuse University with a bachelor's in economics. Oh, oh, okay! <laughs> thank you, thank you. Um, however, before I talk about my digital marketing agency, I just want to talk about my position right now with the NAACP, the North Shore Branch. I am the committee chair for the Youth and Young Adult Council. So if you or someone that you know is interested in furthering the development of our community, especially the youth, because that's our future, right? Please connect with me today. I would love to begin short and long-term initiatives within my community by establishing um, a group of growth-minded individuals to just pursue that. In reference to who I am, I do own my own digital marketing agency, so I support local businesses, any type of business with website, website development and design, SEO optimization, social media management, marketing, anything that you need. So if you see me, feel free to stop, stop by, say hello. And that, that's all I got. Thank you for everyone who I've met, and I'm gonna pass it along. Thank you. Thank you for watching our weekend. So hello, um, we are from Every Town for Gun Safety, and we're also very grateful to be here and this lovely day. Great idea to be here. Um, so every time for gun safety, uh, we're here because gun violence is a public health issue. Yeah. And um, <laughs> we do public education. We try and get our message of be smart for kids out to everybody that is willing to hear about our message. Uh, we try, it's um, promoting safe gun storage. That's what we talk about. Uh, what we usually do is we table like we're doing here today. Uh, we also do free presentations. We go into schools. We go into faith groups, community centers um, with our presentation on safe gun storage. And we try and bring that conversation into communities um, and help people have that conversation about guns. We're not against guns, but we're about educating people on how to keep their guns securely safe in their homes. So let us do I say anything. So we, we've got a partnering relationship with uh, Northwell. In fact, we've given these presentations to new uh, pediatric students because they're very up on the fact Dowling, the president of Northwell, has proclaimed gun violence to be a public health issue. Wow, that was... I think that's pretty much it. Yeah. It's much nicer up here in the shade. Everybody should come up here in the shade <laughs> to get out of the sun. Thank you. But come speak to us at our stand, and we could talk more, and we could get uh, in touch and uh, exchange contact information. If you work with a community organization or in your school, we would be happy to come and connect with you and bring this presentation to your community. Thank you. Thank you.
Anybody who's interested to join me on stage, let's get some workout going and let's have a good time. Light, light, light intermission, okay? Anybody, come on, come up for Zumba. Join me on stage. It's shade in the stage. Shade. Let's get a couple of steps in. NAACP members, please join me. Come on. Let's do the class. Anybody else want to join me just for light? You in the orange. You in the orange. Come join me. <laughs> Michelle. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Dr. Brown, we could do a couple of steps. All NAACP members, mandatory that you join the stage. Kiana, I don't know which, both Kiana, well, one Kiana is here. Oh, both Kianas are here, okay, okay. <laughs> We're vote. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Jeanette, we're ready when you are. I'll hold the mic for you. We're waiting for the music? Okay. Tú 
Up and down. Spin the wheel. Round the wheel. Okay, back to the front. session two. I'll be back in session two. Thank you, everyone.